hello friends in this video i am going to explain ip based virtual host in my last video i have explained name based virtual host whose link right now you can see on the top of the video so let's start ip based virtual hosting in ip based virtual host we need to assign a unique ip address to each and every website that are hosted on the server the major difference between name based and ip based virtual hosting is in name based all websites are hosted on the single ip of the server but in ip based we assign every website a different ip now let's start configuring the ip based virtual host first we go to our server root which is slash etc slash apache2 in this directory we find a another directory sites enabled here is a configuration file we need to edit this file if we want to host multiple website on the server whether it is name based virtual host or ip based virtual host now let's open this file in a text editor see this is the file we have configured this file for the name based virtual host we need to change something here we provide a ip address first 192.168.101.3 now before you assign an ip address to this website check that whether this ip is on your server or not okay uh, i have this ip address in one of my server interface so i have assigned this ip to this website okay we will not change the server name this is document root we will not change the document root also provide a different ip here 192.168.101.3 again this ip is also one of my servers interfaces ip okay when you assign ip address to the website check that this ip address is assigned to your server in any of the interfaces okay the server name is my second website document root is this now save this file okay one more thing in ip based virtual host you need not provide server name why you need not provide server name because in ip based virtual host server identify between the two website using the ip address itself but in name based virtual host since both the website use the same ip address so there is no way server can identify between the website so we must provide server name in name based virtual host but we need not provide this server name in ip based virtual host this is completely optional in ip based okay but we will not remove it now we will save this file now we go to our document root which is var www html see these are the document root for the my for my two website this is for the first website and this is for the second website okay so our apache server configuration is ready now we need to configure our local dns file so we go to our local dns which is slash etc slash host this is our local dns now we need to configure this local dns also so we need to open the file via text editor see these are the configuration for name based we have provided the same ip to the different website now we need to change this one now we provided my first website a different ip which is 
and my second website is a again different IP which is 101.6 okay when you type my first website.com on the browser the browser will resolve this domain into this IP and when you type this domain the browser will resolve this into this IP okay now save this file now let's check our servers IP in IP addresses to check IP addresses type see these are the two IP address I have provided to my website one is 101.3 another is 101.6 so you check before you assign any IP address to your website which are hosted on the server if you assign any other IP which are not in your server interfaces then you might face this problem your server might not start run or your might, uh, website might not get hosted okay so now let's be reload the server service apache 2 reload okay now open any browser and type see these are the two website which are hosted on the server using different IPs so this is IP based virtual host. Thank you.